As a parent, you can protect your child by receiving your flu shot and vaccinating all your children in the household. Because remember, babies under six months old cannot receive their flu shot, yet they are one of the highest risk for becoming seriously ill from influenza. I often get lots of questions about whether a patient should get a flu shot or a flu mist. We can do the flu mist starting from age two up until age 50. Um, the reason to get a shot versus a mist really is if your child has asthma or not. If your child has asthma, they're unable to get the flu mist. The reason being this can cause some wheezing in patients. If your child's wheezed within the last year, we also would not recommend getting the flu mist. The flu mist versus a flu shot are both equally as effective. If you have someone in your family who's getting chemotherapy, someone who's immunocompromised, we do not recommend that a patient get the flu mist if they are gonna be in contact with that patient for at least one week and more like two weeks just to be safe. Some of the side effects profiles you can see um, from the flu mist, you might get a little runny nose, you might get a fever, you might get some mild muscle aches. This is not the true flu. You cannot get the flu from either the shot or the mist, which is something that a lot of people still think. The flu shot and the flu mist both protect you from influenza, which can be deadly in children and adults. It used to be that people who had egg allergies were unable to get the flu vaccine. This no longer is true. If you have an egg allergy, speak with your doctor and we can talk about how to safely administer the flu vaccine in the clinic. The only contraindications to getting the flu vaccine are if you have ever reacted in an allergic manner to the flu vaccine, such as developing hives and shortness of breathing. The other small contraindication is if there's something, a neurologic disease called Guillain-Barre, which is very rare. Speak with your doctor if you have either of those issues. The first time a child is receiving either the flu shot or the nasal spray, they're going to need two doses in the first flu season. This begins when we start giving the children their vaccines from age six months up until the children are eight years old. The reason being is it provides a booster dose from the initial vaccine. After the children have completed the first series, they will only need yearly flu shots after that.